Hi everybody, it's Deb from d, d Art Gallery. Today I am doing a pearl pour cloud over and I got my inspiration from Sarah Taylor. So if you get a chance, check out Sarah's channel. As you can see, I have a 12 by 24 inch canvas here. Um, my base coat is Artist Love Flow Acrylic White and also I added um, to that Quinacridone Nickel Azo Gold from Golden's High Flow. So I have a two-tone base there. Here I'm laying my colors down. I will have in the description all the colors I'm using. Today it's mostly the Pebeo paints. And I'm using Pebeo Blue Green, Payne's Gray, Iridescent Blue Black, Lemon Cadmium um, Yellow, iridescent orange yellow and golden iridescent gold fine mixed together and I am just layering those. I am fast forwarding my video today so it uh, won't take so long to for you to watch all that's going on here. Just doing the tipping process now. The paints are very very thin almost like water. And I, I am pretty happy how this painting turned out. I will have all my pouring mediums in the description also. I did use Sarah Taylor's recipes. Quite a bit of water is added to the paints. Just getting off all that excess paint. I am going to be spending a while um, using my palette knives, my skewer, and then off camera also uh, when we go in for our close up I'll show you how I used the straw and I blew out some of these colors. Right here I'm just um, adding some more of my paint. This is not the cloud over paint yet. This is actually the Payne's Gray, the darker color that you're seeing. Just adding some accents here and there. And this is actually um, a cloud over, po uh, excuse me, a cloud over color. It's Liquitex Basic Silver. adding some lines there just more for the eye to see and if you watch Sarah Taylor she does take quite a bit of time to accent her paintings it does get it does take a little time to get used to the um, the thinner paints this color I'm using here is a very pretty combination of Golden Fluids Nickel Azo Gold and Burnt Sienna. I try and um, add to the lines going in the direction that I think the eye would follow. Again, I'm going back to a, oh, here again is an or, the orange, the orange regular paint that I used. It's the iridescent orange yellow. I do like the flow of this painting, and I especially like the uh, Payne's Gray and the Pebeo Payne's Gray and the Iridescent Blue Black from Pebeo. That is a very pretty color, that Iridescent Blue Black. Thank you. 
Okay, and this is like a mint green color. It was uh, an older color that I had mixed prior. Just adding those accents there. This color I'm using now is actually Liquitex Soft Body Muted Pink. Very, very light pink. And now I am going back to the Payne's Gray, just adding a little more in there. Okay, and this color is a combination of Amsterdam Expert Permanent Matter Lake and Deco Art Extreme Sheen Garnet. It's a deeper, richer pink color. I did get a few cells, and I apologize for the, the bright light in the upper left-hand corner. You can see some of the cells coming through there and below that a little bit. And these cloud over colors are what is supposed to produce those pearl cells. Here I'm using my skewer just to make finer lines again with the Payne's Gray. Just pulling some of that paint out. And then back to the palette knife. I had a lot of fun working with this painting, as you can see. I want to thank you all for coming along on this, this little painting journey with me here today. And I do want to thank all my watchers and my subscribers for helping my channel grow. And then this is that, that darker pink color that uh, Amsterdam Expert Permanent Matter Lake and Deco Art Extreme Sheen Garnet. I'm just playing with that line I made there. Okay, I'm just going to give it a quick torch here. Take a look at it. And like I said, off camera, I did uh, extensive work on it. Here we are for our close up, and here you can see the cells I got in the upper left hand corner, some of those pearl cells. You can see where I blew out on that dark blue there, or Paints gray, I should say. And I blew out on this the pink colors here. And then we're just going. Oh, I did blow out on that, that lighter blue too. Just giving you a really nice close-up here of all the colors. I 
I hope you're enjoying this video. If you do, give me a thumbs up. Share it. Make sure you ring the bell, choose all, so you'll know the next time that I do post a new video. I'm very pleased with how this turned out. And we're going to the upper right hand corner here. It looks almost beachy up in this, this corner. Just going down the right hand side. Subscribe if you haven't. That would help my channel grow also. Here I blew out a lot of these colors. And here I'm trying to show you quite a bit of this painting. Thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Until next time, take care everybody. Bye for now.